teaching your puppy to come when called is the most important thing you can teach it. And that's what I'm going to show you how to do today. of things to reward your puppy when it comes to you really entice that puppy to come whenever you call its name. Dylan, come. Good. Good boy. And if you make the whole recall process a big game, your dog is going to love coming when called. Dylan, come. Good boy. Good boy. Yes. Good boy. Puppies really learn through having fun and through play. Use a variety of rewards when your dog is with you. You can use praise, play, food or toys. Puppies love them all. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Come, good boy, good boy. Is that fun? Oh, whoops, do we slip, do we slip? Good. Big mistake that people make when they call their dogs is to be really boring. But the more motivating you make yourself, the more fun you're going to be to come back to. And you can start this process with your puppy or your adult dog as soon as that puppy or dog comes into your home. Come, come, yes. Also, when you call your pup to you, make sure you touch the collar and around the neck because that really sets up a habit of your dog coming right close to you and being touched. So many dogs, when they're called by their owners, like to come close to them, but not close enough to be touched so that the leash is not put on and the dog taken home. They get smart. So get your dog in the habit of coming when called and being touched by you when they come to you. Here's another mistake that people make. Let's say, for example, you're in the dog park and you call your dog to come to you. Your dog comes to you and then you put the leash on and take the dog home. Well, then dog gets wise. Whenever she calls me to come to her, I go, she puts the leash on, she takes me home. So the next time you call, your dog doesn't come to you. So try calling your dog, giving your dog a great reward and then sending your dog off again. And keep repeating that until you get to the point where your dog will come to you because it never knows whether the leash is going to go on or it's going to get a reward and you change it up. Another great tip for this recall is never get angry with your dog when your dog gets to you. Even if you've called your dog hundreds of times and it's ignored you, the 101st time it comes to you, give it loads of praise. Because if you show your dog that you're angry when it does eventually come to you, your dog is not going to want to respond the next time you do the recall. And that's how you start teaching the puppy recall. I'm Victoria Stillwood, Vicky House Pets.